Hi guys, welcome back to Griffin's Gaming Guides. Today we're going after another medieval trophy. The answer is chicken, where you need to throw 42 chicken legs. This is quite a multi-layer trophy, to be honest with you. Bear with me while I go over the quick and easy steps to be able to get your chicken legs, and more importantly, to be able to get more of them. We'll get to that in a second. The first step is being able to acquire the Witch's Talisman. You can get this from Cemetery Hill, go up the first ramp in the level, make your way all the way to the left, drop down, grab the club, Smash the boulders to get out of this area. Go all the way right. Smash the boulder to get into the little underground section with all the hidden rooms. Once you get to the room with the staircase, you want to go over to the right. Smash the bookcase. With the club equipped, you want to hold circle over the fire. Once your club's on fire, you want to go back into the room with the staircase. Up the stairs, you'll find a room with a load of little prison cells. Light the little kind of circular altar bit in the middle of the room with the fire. Just hit it. That's fine. That'll open up all of your cells. Kill all the enemies, grab the Witch's Talisman, first part of this one's done. Now you've got your Witch's Talisman, you need to make your way over to the Enchanted Earth level. From the start of the mission, go left, you'll find a Witch's Cauldron, it's kind of like a green bubbling pot. Open up your inventory, use the Witch's Talisman on this pot, then after the dialogue's finished with the Witch, which is skippable by the way, accept the quest, you'll then end up in the Ant Caves. Now simply make your way through the ant caves. Once you get to the end, you'll have a boss to defeat. If you've got a ranged weapon, either the crossbow, the longbow, any sort of weapon like that, you'll have a much easier time taking this thing down. Once the ant queen's been defeated, you'll then be back outside. You'll end the witch's quest, and more importantly, she'll give you your 30 chicken drumsticks. Now, the only way this will count towards this trophy is if you press square to throw them. You can press circle to eat a chicken drumstick, but please stay away from this method as it will not work towards this trophy. You can only get this one by throwing them by pressing square. Now that you've gone through all that and actually acquired your chicken drumsticks, make your way over to the hilltop mausoleum level and throw 20, 25 chicken drumsticks away by pressing square. Just stand there and chuck them. They don't have to hit an enemy or anything like that. Just throw them away. Make sure that you keep at least a couple in your inventory for this method to work. Now you need to find an imp that hasn't got a torch in its hand. These are the imps that can actually steal off you. Make sure you've got your chicken drumsticks equipped. They'll then steal them from you. They need to run away back into their hole for the steal to be successful. Once it's all gone down properly, you then want to make your way to a merchant gargoyle. Buy back your chicken drumsticks. You'll get another 30 in your inventory, allowing you more than enough room to be able to get this trophy to unlock. Simply stand there and just throw chicken drumsticks against the wall if need be until your trophy unlocks. Providing you've thrown 42 drumsticks out using square rather than circle, your trophy will unlock as soon as you've got rid of your 42nd one. So guys, I'd just like to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit the like button. Let me know down in the comment section if you need any further information or advice on this trophy. And I'll get to you as soon as I can. Make sure you subscribe to Griffin's Gaming Guides. After you subscribe, please hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future content. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.